Hello friends, I am Vishayak Shivastha and welcome to daily news analysis from Hindu of 22nd October. You can catch me on this link so that you can watch all my history courses and polity crash course along with the editorial analysis of daily Hindu. Okay, so uh, let's start with this leprosy article from Andhra Pradesh. Uh, leprosy, you know, Andhra Pradesh government was giving additional food to leprosy patients. Okay, they used to give food to uh, poor people and additional to the leprosy patients. But what they did, they linked Aadhaar to this benefit. And now it is it be, it's becoming very difficult to uh, do this biometric authentication to the uh, to the uh, leprosy patients, and they are being denied this uh, benefit. A similar issue was being faced when uh, last year government uh, said that we have to make digital life certificates of all the pensioners now after 60 years your fingerprints you know are almost gone okay and it cannot be you know these it cannot be identified or it, it cannot be biometrically authenticated okay and that become a issue at that time so there are few few cons with uh, Aadhaar and you can quote them when you are writing about it PM in Gujarat Pradhan Mantri has recently inaugurated this uh, 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 ferry ferry between Gujarat uh, sorry Saurashtra and southern Gujarat that is between uh, Ghoga Ghoga and the H ferry now the important thing is Saurashtra is a big bit backward area and this connection will definitely gonna help but not just one ferry definitely they need to be more okay and along with that this is connected with Delhi Mumbai industrial corridor so if it, if this part is also connected then definitely this development will help Saurashtra also okay anyhow vadodara is also being uh, converted into a transport hub last month they have started this bullet train means they uh, laid the foundation state of st stone of the bullet train mr modi and shinzo abe together so they'll be starting a ahmedabad mumbai bullet train and this loan is given by japan the reason behind modi ji over here maybe you can call it because there is gujarat election and he has to create that aura over here and that's not nothing bad every party does that okay yesterday only we were discussing chidambaram has questioned election commission uh, that why they are not implementing model code of conduct so that is being replied uh, chief election commissioner ak jyoti is saying that we have not implemented because there is relief operation going on in gujarat and if we implement this then definitely that relief operation going to be affected Secondly, there is a 46 days clause under Supreme Court ruling and the representation of the People Act for uh, completing all the uh, poll process, etc. And if we put it now, then again, again, this relief work gonna be affected. They also said that we will be delinking Gujarat and Himachal, uh, you know, uh, election because they are geographically apart and let's treat them as a separate process. RBI has given this guideline that all the bank accounts should be uh, mandatorily linked with the Aadhaar. Okay, this is being done under money laundering, maintenance of records, sound amendment rules 2017. Okay, so uh, this is this is a good step linking Aadhaar so that you can always uh, always catch people who are not paying uh, in uh, tax and all. Okay, or some black money is there. So this has to be done by 31st December. Okay, now this is a good article. Uh, this is about Yatra to highlight tribal way of agriculture. Now this Yatra is called Jan Jatiya Kisan Swaraj Yatra and they were trying to uh, you know highlight uh, this sustainable farming through rain fed agriculture and indigenous tribal practices. Okay, they were focusing water, forest, land and seed. Now listen, we must understand that all the modern lines you know when we say that uh, agriculture should be grown on modern lines and modernity should be there and gene technology and tractor and uh, this uh, automate automation everything is good and it's welcome it's good really good but one thing somewhere we might forget and that is the you know indigenous knowledge we had about agriculture we are we are it's agriculture is not smartphone that we have started today agriculture we are doing this thing for let's say thousand of years and we have this knowledge of thousand of years we have lived at this place for thousands of years and we we know how much rain uh, how much rain happens every year uh, how much fluctuation is there what kind of uh, soil is there uh, what kind of climate what kind of species is over there what what thing we should eat so we have lived for so long and that is somewhere coded in our indigenous practices indigenous agriculture practices because that is 
you know designed for that thing only so we must not forget that indigenous practices and our tribal people are people are still having it let's gain back from them okay so in that way this is uh, very very important because these practices they focus on resources what we have how much water we have how much rain we have for sure okay not about the fluctuation so these tribes also have a uh, lot of knowledge about how to gather food shifting hill cultivation pastoralism labor handicrafts okay so we must reap benefits of these knowledge along with that one more thing is very 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 important that is uh, tribal people do not grow for the market okay they don't want money they only grow for one thing that's nutrition so when we learn from them we will also focusing on the nutrition thing right okay along with that when we will be growing according to the climate it definitely will be saved from the impacts of the climate change more most importantly many food grains are the at the verge of extinction that is curry kodra bati etc you can learn these names at least three or four of them to write in your, in your answers okay so uh, this gonna be this gonna help a lot in preserving them also okay further few butterfly species are found in singur the singur was famous for nano okay 69 species are discovered by zoological survey of india and five of the species found in singur are rare and they need to be protected under wildlife protection act okay few names are tree flitter striped albatross tea blue common indian crow and denied egg fly you know such questions are being asked now thisur district panchayat they have installed napkin vending machine okay and incinerator incinerators in schools okay for the girls who are uh, facing this menstrual menstrual cycle so this will help in menstrual uh, hygiene now you must understand that that first of all this will sensitize this uh, society this will tell the people this will sensitize the people that uh, such issues are there okay because the stigma attached to this that people are not talking about that that to be that to be eradicated and this can be expected from such developed state only means developed means educated state literate state okay if it was a backward state they must have been talking about midday meal and food security only okay the first thing is and this hygiene issue would be solved the second issue is that you know the uh, these days it is it has been observed that girls of 10 11 years they are having this menstrual cycle okay so to to help them out this machine gonna really help so this is no doubt a very good uh, very good uh, step and uh, can be a part of your essay now 383 policemen we have lost this year okay in one year and this they are being commemorated on october 21st the day when we lost 10 policemen in ladakh in 1959 now this is spain is a burning issue daily we have some news and currently what spain did they have uh, used this article 155 which is similar to our article 356 of state emergency so that government you, you can say that is no, no more there of catalonia but still they have their autonomy okay it's not about self government so the madrid the spain is being supported by the king also and they it is being said that they will conduct the election there again okay so we'll keep on doing that the day we feel that uh, it's complete so we'll do a complete analysis of spain catalonia now decading z's road map now these is z jinping in, is again in news daily now what he saying that what he gonna do what his plan is he is talking about principal contradiction okay now principal contradiction he is saying that he will be implementing principal he will be working on the principal contradiction okay uh, and this principal contradiction basically arises from dialectical materialism now what the dialectical materialism is it is it says that everybody needs everybody has a material need okay they want growth they want something material and that can be anything everybody has a material need so all the social forces have the material need but everybody cannot uh, remember this per, uh, pareto optimality everybody cannot have that growth everybody can't be rich so all these social forces they want this material growth okay so there is contradiction between these social forces they contradict each other they fight with each other not literally fight but still they try to you know oppose each other and this force this friction creates polity and history means these social forces which all of them needs this material need they contradict each other because uh, you know a need of some everybody is same everybody wants money everybody want to be rich okay so this contradiction is actually the polity or history that's the um, uh, concept of dialectical materialism but what the thing it's it's not a negative concept first thing the thing why it is not negative 
we must understand this contradiction and we must try to solve this we must try to pacify all these factions and that is about that's the polity that's the that should be the nature of the polity that should be the aim of the polity and then a good history would be created but if you uh, if you consider it in a wrong way that it is contradictory so contradictions are okay so let us be okay with that let us support one faction which we from which we belong and then it will all be okay so this was read in some way like that inaccurate reading into mao era and there was a disastrous effect there were class wars at that time but now now zee is talking about positive sense okay he's saying that he will be uh, developing india a uh, developing sorry china not india by 2021 and he will convert china into an advanced socialist nation by 2049 okay and this plan will be developed by national development and reform commission that's the pex body over there planning body now it team has come up with uh, this new uh, discovery they extracted plant for this uh, treating skin cancer now what uh, what what they have they saying that if you extract this chlorophyll rich biomolecular extract from anthocyphalus kadamba and you mix that with dye okay this is a recipe you mix with the dye and you put in and you make a nanoparticle from that okay those nanoparticle will be uploaded in the body of the patient these particles will go to all the cells even to the normal cells and to the uh, cancerous cells in the cancerous cells they will go and they will enhance this generation of reactive oxygen species and these ros will give the kill the cancer cell so this is the technology don't try it out don't try it at home okay then uh, scientists at the indian institute of science bangalore they have come up with a new idea of how to detect malaria now what they are saying uh they think that till now we were you know using visual microscope for identifying uh malaria this uh, parasite plasmodium okay but now now what they saying that rbc is close to this plasmodium it becomes rigid now by detecting this rbc will come to know about our uh, uh, malaria so this is a new technique brought forward by isc bangalore okay so now there are some flashes uh now there is a movie marcel and it is uh, this movie has something against the gst or something against some dialogues are th there against uh, uh, bjp so it it is being uh, demanded that it should be censored so congress is supporting them and that's the beauty of the democracy that if you say something every every time there is a party who is countering you okay that may not be positive okay that may always not be positive counter but at least the one who is saying who is doing something he will always have this uh, fear in the back of the mind that there is someone to oppose me okay then again uh, the mosul has been uh, released and now there were there are uh, almost 39 people missing from india and now dna samples are being collected from their family so that their body can be detected okay then we have already discussed the japanese pm abe issue that he is sure going to win win this election but we'll be further uh, discussing japanese election after uh, japanese election actually okay so today in editorial part because uh, there is nothing like editorial today some discussion is there so i'll be taking up two topics that is rohingya crisis and kang ganga be killed fiend rohingya crisis is not covered today uh, in today's paper but i will completely com uh, discuss this how what your stand should be there how it occurred what the history is everything okay along with there was article today can ganga be cleaned i will discuss this thanks a lot for watching and please do rate review and recommend these sessions and please do share with your friends and bahut sari mehnat karo keep learning thank you